how to conduct a swab test. Hello there. If you're watching this video, you're probably considering becoming a potential blood stem cell donor. If you haven't yet registered, you can do so on our website by filling in our online registration form and we'll send you a do-it-yourself swab kit. The purpose of the swab kit is to obtain tissue cells from your mouth for genetic typing. The hope is that you will be matched to a patient who is in need of a blood stem cell donation. It's an extremely simple process and now I'm going to show you how it's done. Open up the plastic packaging in your swab kits and take out the swabs. Be careful not to touch the swab tips with your fingers. Remember to use each swab only once to take a tissue sample. Swallow the excess saliva in your mouth before you start to make your mouth dry. Also, remember to keep your mouth open while swabbing. Swab the inner wall of both cheeks and the gum lining of the upper and lower jaw for 60 seconds. Use comfortable pressure in a circular motion, rotating the stick from time to time. Make sure to firmly swab your cheeks to collect enough cells because remember, saliva is not enough. Repeat the same swabbing process with the second and third stick for 60 seconds each. Be careful to ensure that the tips don't come into contact with any surfaces. Once you are done, air dry the swabs for 5 minutes. Then place them securely into the bottom of this envelope without the plastic packaging. Use the sticky tab to close it. You then stick one of the barcode labels which has been provided on the consent form onto the front of the envelope. The second barcode label is only provided as a backup in case the first one gets damaged. Also remember that you will need to review and sign the consent form. Finally, put the swab envelope and your signed consent form into the enclosed prepaid postage envelope and drop it off at your nearest post box or post office. And that's it. Your contribution could potentially save a life. So thank you for your support.